Hey y'all, Kevin here, and this is Pure Reviews, where I review all kinds of products. So if you are new to the channel, be sure to hit that subscribe button. And if you find this particular video helpful, be sure to hit that like button, leave a comment. All those really help out the channel a ton. So today's product is available on Amazon, so I'm going to include a link in the description that will take you to the product page, so you can check out the current price point, see if it's on sale, and all that fun information. But what is it? So today's product is a solar power, basically pendant light by a company called Loto Fit. This is the bag or the box that it's going to come in uh, once you order it. And once you open it up, you're going to get a bunch of parts and pieces. So let's show you what those are. First off, you're going to get a little um, user manual instruction, but we're going to go over all those details. You are going to get a USB to USB type C charging cable. Then you are going to get the solar panel itself. So this is the solar panel right here. And then it has um, a nice super long cable. So this cord is 16.5 uh, feet. So you can basically position the solar panel pretty far from the light itself, or you can hang the light pretty high depending on your setup. Now to give you an idea of the solar panel size, uh, this is seven and a half by seven and a half. So it is basically a perfect square. Uh, it does have some of this little like um, protective plastic coating, which is kind of a pain to peel off. But uh, that is, you just kind of work on it and it will come off um, over as you just kind of peel it off over time. So that's kind of annoying thing on the solar panel itself, but no big deal. Uh, once it's removed, it's removed. So then you are also going to get, they're going to include like a little bracket here um, for attaching the solar panel. So this will screw in the sides and then you can attach this either to like a fence or the side of your house or uh, basically wherever you want. And then they're going to include some hardware here for the bracket. Then finally, and most importantly, you are going to get the solar panel light itself. So here is the light. Um, essentially there is the cord here. So this is what is going to hang um, or plug into the solar panel itself. Now on the side here is where you can actually charge it up. So let's talk about charging. Uh, this thing has a 5,400 mAh battery which uh, if you charge it up via the solar panel, it's gonna take about six to eight hours to fully charge. If you charge it up with the USB cable, it's gonna take about four to five hours to charge up. Um, now, as far as life, what, how long it's gonna stay on, that is drastically going to change depending on all your various different modes. So, and the reason I say that is it has, um, four different brightness levels, three different color temperatures, uh, if you have it set up to the dust till dawn feature. So a lot of that's just gonna, it's just gonna tweak depending on what you have going on with it. But there is also a little uh, guy right here so you can hang it. This is removable. So if you don't want it, you can just take it off. Um, but it has, makes it easy to hang if you're gonna hang it outside like in a tree or something like that. Uh, and then there's a button here where you can actually, on the device, control the different color temperatures. So you can turn it off, um, and then as you can see, it was actually being motion censored there. Um, but yeah, so it has a lot of different little options and controls, which can all be controlled with the button. You do have to kind of just work through all the various modes and settings by pressing that. One other thing it does come with, it also includes a remote control that makes it easy to control. So as you can see on the remote control, you have an on off button, you have the basically the dimming option, the white to warm option, and then you have the timers here. So if you wanna just have it basically turn on at night for one hour, you can do that two hours, four hours, eight hours, or the auto will be the uh, full dusk till dawn. Uh, as far as, so going back on that battery life, um, if you use the lowest setting and the lowest dimming, you're gonna get uh, basically 10 hours out of that. So, um, or sorry, not 10 hours, you're gonna get uh, 40 hours out of it. So it'll last multiple days on that lowest, lowest setting. If you have it on the brightest setting and everything on um, its max, then you're gonna get approximately 10 hours out of that. So 
it should last for a majority of the night, depending on where you live, um, which is important. Now, uh, as far as the device itself here, um, it has, as you can see, all the LED nodes here. Um, it has approximately about 100 of them. This is six and three quarters inch in diameter. Um, and this output at full can produce a thousand lumens. Um, so that is uh, the brightness level. It also has an IP rating of 65, so it can handle the elements, the rain, the snow, etc. But uh, let's kind of turn it on here. So as you can see, this is, we'll change to the warm light. This is the warmest setting. This is going to be basically the brightest setting at five, thousand kelvins the other one was three thousand kelvins and then in the middle if you hit the ww on the remote that is going to be a blend between the two at four thousand kelvins now i don't know if my camera is going to pick this up but we will try it so this is the brightest let me go to the white this is the brightest setting and then you can dim it down one dim it down two dim it down three and this is the lowest brightness setting so you have one two three and then there's your four as your brightest. So, um, and then basically then down here is like I said, the timer function. So it will blink when it is set up in the timer mode, um, just to kind of let you know. Now on the device itself, you can see it right there. This is what it's using for the remote. Um, and then when you plug it in, um, I can't really see where it is. It may be it may be right around there. But basically, there will be a green light that turns on. Kind of lets you just, it's a little indication so you know that it is charging and uh, powering on up. So if you're curious, you're like, I'm not sure it's working, uh, there is a little light that turns on. But yeah, so this is overall this cool little pendant light. It makes a great little outdoor decoration, especially I suggest like hanging from a tree. Um, if you want to add a little punch of light somewhere. Uh, if you are in the market for a solar power light, I totally do recommend this little guy. Uh, it is nice and compact, very, very bright. If you have any questions or comments, feel free to hit me up in the comment section. I do typically respond to those. Um, and that is it. So check out the link in the description. And until the next video, you guys take it easy. Later. Congrats, you made it to the end of the video. Thank you very much. Um, greatly appreciated for the support. Be sure to uh, hit that like button on the video. It really, really does help out. And if you have not subscribed yet, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and hit the notification bell if you want to uh, get notified when new videos come out on this channel.